Hmm. Night crawlers. You will do. Let's see if y'all still alive. Uh. Ooh, they're alive and ready to get eaten. All right, so y'all seen me grab the worms. Now I got everything else in here. Got my hooks, got my BB sinkers and everything else. So I'm gonna go after me some ready as sunfish, some kind of sunfish, something along that nature. And hopefully we get them because I ain't got a lot of time and tomorrow it is going to storm and I'll be at work. So hopefully we can catch some fishes today. Just got out here back in the place I haven't fished in a while. I actually see a, a massive school of shiners that's right underneath me right now. Nothing's really blowing up on them too much. I'm gonna sit out here and I'm gonna try to catch some sunfish for y'all today. This is what I'm gonna try to do. Hopefully we can catch them. The water looks beautiful. So let's get to it. There we go. Got one. Finally. Man, that took a while. That took a while. It took way longer than what it should have took. Look how pretty though. All the orange on the belly. Blue. Little bluegill. Jesus, man. Caught another one, but not as pretty as the first one. Definitely not as pretty as the first one, but oh well. Fell in the water. Well, let's try to get some more. Finally starting to get some bites. It was a kind of a struggle to find where they were this earlier. I mean, just a little bit ago, and now I kind of got bites on every single my last cast, but. I think we're just finding a spot where they just hold them over here underneath this tree, past these logs. They're definitely being super, super, super finicky. There we go. There we go. So, probably fishing about two foot down. I need a cork with some live night crawlers. Open your mouth. Pretty little bluegill. Not pretty like the one I seen earlier though. Love catching little fish. Most of us grew up doing this. It's not bad to come out here and do it. It's fun, especially for kids. Or if you just want to get a little bit of action, go out and catch a few fish to eat. Perfect thing to do. Oh, all right, we're starting to get into them now. But they are professional bait stealers, I will tell you that. God, there's no way. They're totally submerged. And they still don't get it. Don't get the hook. I don't get it. It's just crazy. It's crazy how they can avoid that hook. I'm going to eat the whole bait. No, I'm just going to peck, peck, peck it. Peck it until it comes off. Oh, turn. Boom, you fucking bitch. Caterpillar, man. Gotcha. Finally. A little turd. A little bait stealer. A little bait stealer. I damn had a caterpillar on my neck. I will tell you this what I've noticed so far. If I got a little piece of bait on here, they don't want to touch it. They want a bigger piece. So that's what we're going to do. Keep loading up with some worms, some bigger size of worm.